okay uh, so today i'm going to talk about uh, replicating pivot table without making any impact to the source one usually when we make a duplication of the pivot table and change its grouping or fields the the source table also gets impacted so i'm going to show you a simple technique of how you can avoid it so you can make as many copies of your original pivot table uh, and change them slightly uh, without increasing the file size or uh, without much of complication so i have a small uh, table here to make my pivot table out of it and i'm going to name the range of this table as inventory 1 and i'm going to insert a pivot table using that range inventory 1 so just for the demonstration i'm dragging few fields to make a real table there you go now i want to make a copy of it so to do that select the pivot table copy it and paste it into a new sheet completely just to make the widths of the cells consistent and now what are the grouping make changes i make here you can see the original pivot table also got impacted in the other sheet which i used to copy so it's not a real copy what are the changes i make to one affects the others now i can create another range completely with the same cell range i'm naming it as inventory 2 and i'm going to change the source of my copy table to the new name range that is inventory 2 so the the source table uses the inventory 1 name range and my copy table uses inventory 2 name range now you can see the changes i make on my copy table is not impacting the source table that means now both the tables are isolated completely all i did is i just created another name range uh, within excel which is not going to increase the file size and the changes of my one table not impacting the other it's very simple i hope you found this useful uh, please make sure you read my complete post as well uh, for the step by step instructions again thank you